But this new time, we are first tracking that developing news on a big drug bust by Rhode Island State Police. A Providence man now facing charges of drug trafficking found with nearly two pounds of the most potent drug in the country. And this morning, he was set to face a judge. I would assume reporter Kate Walsh working the latest now from court in Providence. Well, Danielle, large quantities of drugs are off the street of Providence now after this bust on Wednesday morning in Providence. And this morning, Eyewitness News was inside Providence District Court behind me, where the man arrested in that bust was arraigned. A noticeable collective gasp in Providence District Court as state police read the charges against 52 year old Jesus Ramos. 895 grams of uh, heroin, which would later field test, Your Honor, and, um, and fentanyl, Your Honor, as well as uh, other articles of uh, drug paraphernalia. State police say nearly a kilo of drugs and nearly $35,000 worth of fentanyl were seized at a basement apartment at 102 Ford Street in Providence, where Ramos was allegedly staying. Though in court, through a translator, he said he didn't have an address. Ramos was arrested around 11.30 Wednesday morning following an investigation by members of the Rhode Island State Police Police task forces, the U.S. Marshals Service, Homeland Security, and the Boston Police Department. Ramos was arraigned Thursday morning on several felony drug related charges in Rhode Island and was presented as a fugitive from justice out of Massachusetts, where he faces several more felony drug and gun charges. Due to the severity of the charges, Ramos was ordered held without bail until his bail hearing on July 5th. And according to Rhode Island State Police, every person who is convicted of serious drug charges, like the ones he faces and is being charged with, could face up to life in prison or pay a fine of $500,000 or both. Live in Providence, I'm Kate Walsh, Eyewitness News.